Hello today's video we have the following content. Liu Yifu has become a model in the entertainment industry with both inner and outer beauty. At the age of 37, her girlishness has not diminished but increased. In the entertainment industry, the age boundary seems to be always blurred and clear. When the 37-year-old Liu Yifu made a stunning appearance in the story of Rose as a girl, the whole network was boiling. How did she break the curse of time is unforgiving and go against age, still youthful. Behind this, it is not only the secret of her natural beauty, but also her inner and outer beauty, common and her model in the entertainment industry. Today, let us uncover the truth of Liu Yifu's frozen age and explore how she maintains her unique charm in the long river of time. Liu Yifu, this name has long been closely linked to the image of fairy sister. In the story of Rose, she once again appeared as a 22-year-old college student, which amazed the audience. Compared with the ridicule that other post-85s actresses encountered when playing girls, Liu Yifui once again proved her strength and charm with the work. How did she do it? In the entertainment industry, appearance and acting skills are often important criteria for measuring an actor. Liu Yifui is the perfect combination of the two. She not only has an angelic face and a devilish figure, but also has superb acting skills and profound acting skills. In the story of Roses, she showed Wang Yimui's youthful vitality through delicate performance. Every look and every movement makes people seem to see the energetic girl. However, Liu Yifui's charm is not limited to appearance and acting skills. Her heart is also rich and strong. In the entertainment industry, she always maintains a sober and independent mind. She loves reading traveling, and every moment of life. This love and pursuit of life makes her heart full of strength and confidence. When faced with doubts and criticisms, she can always respond calmly, showing a unique charm and demeanor. From the fairy sister when she debuted to the ageless goddess today, Liu Yifui's transformation is full of hardships and difficulties. She has proved the value and charm of an actor with her own efforts and sweat. She constantly challenges herself and breaks through herself, and has achieved fruitful results in her acting career. Her success is not only due to her beauty and acting skills, but also because of her perseverance and courage. So, how does Liu Yifui maintain this frozen age? In fact, the answer is very simple, both inside and outside. She not only pays attention to maintenance and exercise on the outside, but also pursues richness and fulfillment in her heart. She loves reading, learning, and every moment in life. This love and pursuit of life makes her heart full of strength and confidence. At the same time, she also pays attention to being kind to others and being with others. She has won the love and support of the audience with her sincerity and kindness. This lifestyle of both inside and outside has allowed her to maintain her unique charm in the long river of time. Liu Yifui's frozen age secret is not only applicable to celebrities in the entertainment industry, but also to each of us. We should all pay attention to both inside and outside, and maintain our love and pursuit of life. Only in this way can we maintain our charm and style in the long river of time. At the same time, we should also learn from Liu Yifui's perseverance and courage to constantly challenge ourselves and break through ourselves on the road of life to live out our own splendor and value. Liu Yifui's ageless secret shows us the persistence and hard work of an actor and how an ordinary person can live out his or her own splendor and value. She has proved the importance of both inner and outer cultivation with her actions and set a positive example for us. Let us learn from Liu Yifui's spirit and attitude and keep moving forward on the road of life to create our own wonderful life. Next news. Lin Yi shared his experience of working with Liu Yifui, and was very excited that his dream came true. Recently, Lin Yi shared his unique experience of working with Liu Yifui in an interview. He excitedly said that working with this long-time idol of his was like a dream coming true. Recalling his first encounter with Liu Yifui. Lin Yi described it as a lively occasion when the crew of the story of Rose had a dinner. He said frankly that Liu Yifui's appearance seemed to have her own aura, her beauty and elegance were eye-catching, and he was almost shocked by her temperament. And Liu Yifui's kindness and easygoingness made Lin Yi feel warm in addition to being nervous. Talking about the cooperation process, Lin Yi frankly said that although the two had a large age difference, their tacit understanding in the play was unexpectedly perfect. They played a pair of sister-brother lovers, and their interaction in front of the camera was as natural as real lovers. Liu Yifui's dedication and professionalism made Lin Yi admire her. She took every shot seriously and analyzed the role and depth, which taught him a lot. For this cooperation, Lin Yi said that he cherished it very much. He said frankly that Liu Yifui is not only one of the most outstanding actors he has ever worked with, but also an important mentor in his life. 
He looks forward to more opportunities to work with Liu Yifei in the future and challenge more different types of roles together. Netizens also spoke highly of the cooperation between Lin Yi and Liu Yifei. They all said that their performance in the story of Rose was impressive, and their tacit understanding and feelings were even more moving. Many fans are looking forward to them joining hands again to bring us more wonderful works. In short, the cooperation between Lin Yi and Liu Yifei is undoubtedly a successful attempt. Their tacit understanding and feelings make the audience feel the strong atmosphere of love, and also make us look forward to their future performance. Next news. Why does Liu Yifei never take on Qing Dynasty Palace dramas? When she puts on the Zhan Huan costume, the drama ends as soon as she appears. Why does Liu Yifei never take on Qing Dynasty Palace dramas? When she puts on the Zhan Huan costume, the drama ends as soon as she appears. As an actress with outstanding acting skills and high appearance, Liu Yifei has always attracted much attention in the entertainment industry. Although she has appeared in many types of film and television dramas, she has never taken on a Qing Dynasty Palace drama. This has raised many people's questions, why is she unwilling to try this type of drama? As an actor, Liu Yifei considers the characteristics of the character and the appeal of the plot when choosing a script. Qing Dynasty Palace dramas usually focus on the theme of harem fighting, and the plot is complicated and full of power struggles. Maybe Liu Yifei prefers to choose roles with depth and emotion rather than overly commercial plots. Liu Yifei's image has always been fresh and elegant, pure and beautiful, which is different from the image of the characters in Quang Dynasty Palace dramas. Although she has worn Quang Dynasty costumes, she is more suitable for showing a fresh and natural temperament rather than the domineering image of a harem lady. As an actor, Liu Yifei also hopes to challenge more different types of roles to show her acting skills and performance ability. She may prefer to choose roles that are different from her previous works to show her diversity. Liu Yifei is a high-profile actress whose beauty and acting skills have always been a topic of conversation among the audience. Although she has been involved in various types of film and television dramas in the entertainment industry, she has never taken on a Quang Dynasty drama, which has aroused the curiosity and speculation of many people. In order to better understand why Liu Yifei does not take on Quang Dynasty dramas, we need to explore her acting choices in personal style and depth. As an actor, Liu Yifei is very cautious in choosing roles. She pays attention to the connotation and emotional expression of the role, and prefers to choose roles with depth and uniqueness. Qing Dynasty dramas usually take the struggle in the harem as the theme, with complex plots and full of power struggles. This type of script may not be consistent with the role style she pursues. Liu Yifei prefers to challenge roles with emotional resonance and inner world, and show the complexity and growth of the role through delicate performances. Liu Yifei has always shown a fresh and elegant image. Her temperament and beauty are different from the image of the characters in Quang Dynasty dramas. The characters in Quang Dynasty dramas usually need to show a certain majesty and authority, while Liu Yifei is more suitable for showing a fresh, natural, innocent and lovely image. Her appearance and temperament make it easier for her to resonate with the audience in costume dramas, while her image in Quang Dynasty dramas may make the audience feel a little distant. As an actor, Liu Yifei is eager to challenge different types of roles and show her acting skills and performance ability. She hopes to let the audience see her diversity and growth through different character shaping. Taking on Quang Dynasty dramas may limit her performance space and make it difficult for her to show her unique charm and acting skills. Liu Yifei's refusal to take on Quang Dynasty dramas is based on her consideration of role selection in pursuit of personal style. She prefers to choose roles with depth and emotional resonance to show her acting skills and performance ability. Her fresh and natural image and unique temperament make her more attractive in costume dramas, while the character image in Quang Dynasty dramas may not fully show her charm. As an audience, we should respect her choice and look forward to her wonderful performance in other types of dramas. Liu Yifei still has a long way to go in her acting career, and I believe she will bring us more surprises and wonderful performances. Thank you for watching the video. Please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel,